This, in my opinion, is the best way to turn any video into a reel. So stop shooting vertical video. Do this instead. What's up everybody, I'm Raul, a brand strategist and content creator here with The Dude Media. And I help small to medium sized businesses connect with their audiences through brand strategy and content creation. So you just shot a video and now you wanna turn it into a reel and share it across all of your social media channels like Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, and YouTube Shorts. The best way that works for me is through an app called Adobe Rush. It has two features that will help you turn any video into a reel by using magic. Yes, actual magic. The first feature I wanna show you is called Auto Reframe. Auto Reframe uses AI to figure out what the subject is in your video. So when you reformat your horizontal video into a vertical video, it will center that subject as best as it can and in my opinion, it does an amazing job at doing that. So here's how you use it. Create your project and import your footage. Place it on the timeline, then just tap the auto reframe icon. It will give you a few options, 16 by nine, nine by 16, four by five, and one by one. Select the nine by 16 format. This format is best for reels, for real. Click on the effects panel on the toolbar, then Click on motion and then select auto reframe. And just like that, Rush will center your subject throughout the entire video. If your clip doesn't center exactly, then you can click on the adjust frame to nudge your clip and it will save your adjustments. You can also control the speed of the pan by selecting motion tracking. Select slower to make it look a little bit more natural or select faster for a quick pan. That's just to get all the action. The reason why you wanna film horizontally is because you wanna be able to repurpose your videos instead of filming different versions of the same video. This method is called non-destructive. It's called that because in the project file, it will not delete the sides of the video that you crop off when you reformat it to vertical. So you can go back and change the format anytime. It's non-destructive. On the other hand, if you were to shoot the entire video vertically, you lose all that footage on the sides. The second feature that is awesome is the auto ducking feature. And it's pretty ducking cool. You can use this when you want to add background music. This will automatically lower the volume of the music when there's someone speaking. It will also automatically raise the volume once that person is done speaking. This will work throughout your entire video just by clicking the auto ducking feature. Let me show you how to do it. Import your music to the project and then scroll and click on audio on the toolbar. Scroll again and click on auto ducking. So I'm gonna talk for just a second so you can hear the volume of the music lower while I'm talking. And then I'm gonna pause for a second so you can hear the music adjust. You hear that? It's pretty cool, huh? And there you have it. Give it a listen and make any adjustments needed. These two features alone can save you so much time in the editing process. You can also repurpose one video for multiple platforms, saving you from re-recording the video from each platform. You are welcome. Thanks for watching today's video. If you liked this video, please be sure to hit that like button and subscribe. Thanks for watching and until next time guys, peace.